It started 18 years ago. I uh, got a call to go out to the married student housing on a uh, auto theft. One of the residents had his car stolen overnight. And so I went out there and met with them. And a real nice individual, he and his wife and two children. They had their car stolen. A few days later, I got a call from APD that the car was recovered along with other cars that had been stolen. and uh, They found him in a cemetery, which was part of a gang initiation. Uh, they stole the cars, took them there, vandalized the cars, broke the windows out, and just made, you know, made them a mess. So uh, I called the resident out there because I knew he had no other form of transportation, told him his car was located and it was in the pound, and after work I would come by and pick him up. So I did, and we got and got to the car, and it was just uh, torn up. All the windows were broken out, the side mirrors broken off, uh, things stripped out of it, just really, really a mess. And he was pretty much in tears due to the fact of the proximity to Christmas and knowing that that was their only form of transportation and the money that they'd be out to repair the vehicle. And I looked at him, I said, well, you know, people around here like to help each other. And I had a friend that his uh, son worked in a wrecking yard. And uh, I made a call and the son asked his boss if uh, they'd mind helping repair the car, you know, the replacement parts and stuff. And uh, they did. He had a very nominal fee, which helped out greatly. You know, this was a foreign student, you know, man, wife, and two children, and very limited income. So uh, even with that, you know, when I met with him, you know, he was very appreciative of the fact that we were able to do that, and the people out at the wrecking yard actually put the windows in for him and did a lot of the repair for him at no cost. So, uh, you know, he said, hey, you know, uh, you know, I really appreciate all the help, and it saved a lot of money. Uh, but, you know, Christmas is right around the corner and all the money I had saved up for gifts is now spent repairing the vehicle. I said, well, things happen around here and don't worry about Christmas because it'll be here and things will take care of themselves. So uh, I went out and bought, I guess it was Five or six toys for each child. Christmas morning, I got up about, uh, out at the married student, uh, about 7.30, quarter to eight, knocked on the door, woke everybody up, and had my Santa hat on, and had a bag full of toys that were all wrapped, and the kids, he came to the door, and the kids behind him, and mom behind them, and it was just a wonderful Christmas, and just super, friendly, very nice family, uh, tears of joy. It was great. I mean, it, you know, it was heartwarming that you could do something that helped somebody out that had a misfortune like that. 